Lisa Schmidt gives readers everything you ever look for in a middle grade book in her latest read, Heart and Souls. There's ghosts, drama, and heart. I truly love Lisa's new novel. To be honest, I haven't discovered many spooky reads I'm tempted to dive into, yet alone like enough to talk about, but Heart and Souls is an exception. It's not just her way of perfectly crafting fun and just enough fright into her storylines, but I also was grateful that Lisa didn't sugarcoat middle school. Here's a little bit about the story. Hart is very nervous about starting middle school. Having had one too many panic attacks and having had to face countless boys in elementary school, middle school is not on the top of Hart's list of places he wants to be at the moment. How could it? After the horrible things he went through at his elementary school, he's heading to an even bigger school with seven times the amount of kids as his old stomping grounds. And the first day of school is already not just a bit scary, but a bit spooky. First, he bumps into a kid who calls him a mama's boy, but when Hart responds, the boy in the hoodie seems shocked. Another time, he sees a girl in summer pacing around his classroom, and when he brings her up in a discussion, well, it seems as if nobody else saw her. Something strange is going on. It's almost like they're... no, it, it can't be. They might be ghosts. At lunch, he's asked to meet the group by the bike racks, and that's when they tell Hart the truth. They are ghosts. And they've been haunting the middle school for a few years, some for even decades. They all have unfinished business, and now it seems as if it's Hart's job to fix their problems. Some are harder than others to clean up, but he's got this. Read Heart and Souls to find out what happens next in this thrilling and heart palpitating read. Heart and Souls is a story I will never forget. I wasn't sure what this read would be like when I first decided to dive in. But Lisa Schmidt did a fabulous job interweaving deep emotions and experiences into a funny and heartwarming read. Spooky may not always be my jam, but when I feel so much heart and soul inside a novel, you know I love it. And you will too! This is a quick and sweet read with some howling, ghouling twists and some incredible turns. It's a spooky good time. A 10 out of 10.